Welcome to another episode of Pistons of Fury. In this episode, I continue the livery work on my Mustang. All right, so while I'm waiting for some paint to dry, um, the next step obviously is throwing the number on, um, on my number circle in the trunk. Um, but given that I have to do three more of those, including that one, I thought it would be a good idea now to make a template, which is probably something that I should have done before I started the original one. So um, I took a bunch of measurements off of um, one of the template provide. So there's a Raceline Digital provides vinyl templates. So if you've got a nice Mustang with like nice paint that vinyl can stick to you can order one of their kits they're pretty cheap they're pretty nice they've got all the original livery um, so anyway you can buy one of those but so from their diagrams on their site i did some scaling and uh, basically calculated the, the dimensions of this um, so sketch those out onto this this like yellow construction paper and um, also made myself a mathematically correct um, diagram of the crown so i don't have to screw around with that anymore um, I will probably overlay this onto the door that I already have done and fix that. So what I'm going to do here is I've got it all mapped out. I'm just going to cut, basically come through and cut inside of all my lines so that I can lay this up on the car and, um, and just trace it. So it needs to be a little bit smaller when I trace it. That way I don't end up with a larger number than I should have. Um, yeah, so that's where I'm at. I'm going to throw this on the, the number on the back and uh, sketch it out and then get back to painting.
right, so here's how it is. Um, basically, I'm at a point where I have to go to Costa Rica to go surfing tomorrow, and I didn't get as much done as I wanted to. Theme of the theme of the channel, right there, and probably most YouTube car channels. Um, so, just a little recap. Uh, I was able to do the the hood here. So this is the Punisher. Um, probably needs a little more coat on the yellow, and then I've got to figure out my clear coat situation. Um, the side here is looking pretty good. I mean that, you know, that little yellow crown is kind of the accent piece, but it, it just ties the whole thing together. I was thinking about doing some kind of uh, yellow accent on the, the Pistons of Fury on the sign back there, but uh, that, that might just be too much. I think, I think the way it's set up now is that, uh, yeah, the crown is kind of the unifying piece. Um, and then finally on the trunk, the deck lid, whatever you want to call it, um, that is also done. So when I get back from surfing, um, basically what I need to do is um, get back in the garage, um, hopefully not get sucked back into too much work stuff, and then um, get the car out of the garage, flip it around so I actually have room to work because the other side is kind of pressed up against my toolbox and that whole side I'd, I'd like more room to work. Um, so I'm going to do that and then um, once I get all the artwork on the car, I'm also considering possibly coming through here with some sandpaper. Um, there are some uh, some brush strokes and things like that, so I might try to age that up a little bit to match the car. I don't know yet. I'm not sure I might do a test piece and see how that works out. But anyway, that's what's next for the car. I gotta weatherproof these things once I get them done. Hopefully, I'm gonna try my best to get all that done in the next episode so you guys have that. And from that point, it's just getting this car to the DMB, getting it registered, and then finally making a driving video for all you guys who've actually been watching in real time as this car has progressed. So, making good progress. Um, didn't get as far as I wanted this episode. I gotta make it up next episode, but that's just how this stuff goes. You know, life gets in the way. Um, fortunately for me, life right now means surfing is getting in the way. So that's awesome. Um, Throw me a like, like the video, please subscribe to the channel. I'd uh, love to hear comments, thoughts on this. Um, if, if you think this is interesting, if you think it's stupid, I also wanna hear that. Um, yeah, but anyway, thanks thanks for all the support, everything you guys uh, have been doing. It's, it's really great, it just keeps me motivated, keeps me moving on the project, so really appreciate that. Um, thanks, and I will see you next week.